Awesome. Nice. And we got the giveaway started. Nice. What's up, Garo? How's it going? Zagnor, what's going on? How's everyone doing today? Welcome back, Jersey Girl Thrifter. Got some good book bundles today. Especially if you have kids, I'd say probably between 3 to 10. Probably is a good age range for today's selection of books. Drop some follows here, and then we'll go over the giveaway. Let me finish the chat scroll. All right. Nice. Uh, giveaway is going to be for this Peanuts comic from 2000. This is a, I think it's one of the last few comics that he put out before he died. So you're going to get this one. It's going to be bagged and boarded, but you're also going to get a, a pull out of the pencil box. So I'll just kind of just kind of put that, I don't know, in the back back there. You get a pull out of the pencil box. What's up, Zorro, Rob 75 What's happening? Welcome back. Milo, welcome back. <clears throat> I'll probably just let this run out until the end. Get everybody in here. <clears throat> and we'll see. Let's see what we got. We're going to go in the store and see what is has little bells on it because that means people are interested. And we'll start maybe with those. Let's see if we got we got the Supernatural book bundle. And I got a Lord of the Rings book bundle. All right. C Nap, welcome back. Jay Carter, welcome back. Grab yourself an entry into the giveaway. It is for the Peanuts comic, and you get a pull out of the retro pencil box. It's like a nice 90s pencil. There is some Lisa Frank stuff in the uh, pencil box, so. And what we'll do is I'll run a couple auctions so you can, if you haven't been with me before here on an auction for books, um, <clears throat> I'll run a couple auctions first so you can kind of get a feel for what a normal bundle looks like, I guess. Welcome back, Anu, Lakeshore Legends. Welcome in. Jawbreaker Zulu. Welcome, welcome. Grab yourself an entry into the giveaway. It's for the Peanuts comic in the background and the uh, pencil box pull. You get a pencil box pull from the retro. I usually only do the pencil box during book auctions. So we'll do two pulls from the pencil box. We'll get you two pencils today from the opening stream giveaway. What's up, Blux Deals? Welcome in. Steve Weston, welcome back. And welcome back, Lord Jupiter. Like I said, I'll run a couple bundles after we get the giveaway uh, winner drawn. And then if you haven't been with me before, you can kind of see how I do my uh, book bundles. I'll run a couple uh, in the beginning. And then, again, any purchase today will get you an entry into that uh, buyer appreciation giveaway, which is the uh, Hallmark book bundle and one of those books being a velvet copy of The Secret Garden. So. Let's grab yourself an entry in there and then kind of show off the bundles. We'll go through some of the bundles. Let me make sure I have everything in here. Just going through my store real quick, make sure everything is ready to go. Looks like everything. So I got three different science book bundles, but they're not next to each other. Where's the third one? There's a cyber science library. Um, do, 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 do. Where's the third one? I know there's a third one in here. I thought there was. Ah, uh, biology. Okay, cool. Biology. All right. So I was looking for. All right, let's catch up with chat here. Gavin Free, welcome back. What's up, Parker Prayer? 
All right, let's draw on the winner here. Let's see who's taking home the Peanuts comic from 2000. Lord Jupiter, nice. Nice take home there. You're taking home the bagged and boarded Peanuts comic from January 2000. So one of the last few comics that he uh, published before he, he passed. And then we're going to do two pulls out of the pencil box. What do we got? I can't bear to be without Jesus. And it's got little bears on it. And then you got a nice clean eraser on that one, unsharpened. Let's grab another one in there. What do we got? Welcome to school. And it's got a little, is that, Cal, it looks like Calvin and Hobbes almost. Oops, Calvin and Hobbes maybe getting on the school bus. It's a nice little foil pencil. And this one is, oh, it's a Moonbeams. Pew, pew, pew. That's a big hit. Moonbeams are legit. Nice take home there. Hey, thank you. Appreciate you for coming in. Nice. Yeah, this one was a, this one's a clipping actually from this one, St. Pete Times. St. Pete Times. Uh, this one was a clip from. Put that aside. Let me grab the pencil box and we'll put that back in play when we do the buyer appreciation giveaway. I got a little Lord of the Rings fantasy bundle we'll start out with. It's got a couple books in there um, that you probably haven't seen before. All right, first one is going to be – oops, let's turn this up a little bit. Let's turn this – there we go. First one's going to be this uh, fantasy book in here called Green Darkness. It's a hardcover. It still has the original uh, slipcover on it, which is nice. It's got like a druid and a – I don't know, little – Maiden, call her, call her Maiden. Then we got the QPB Companion to Lord of the Rings. Very cool. Nice little companion reader. Oh, there's a, there's a crossword puzzle on the back. What? Let's see. Oh, there is. There's a crossword puzzle apparently in here. That is Lord of the Rings oriented. And then there's a bunch of maps in the back, which allows you to follow along Mordor. Look at that. Very cool. All right, Lord of the Rings Companion. Then we have some older ones. Uh, this one's going to be a uh, Smith and Wooden Smith of the Wooden Major Farmer Giles of Ham. Now this one is an older one, like I was saying. Let's see how old we got. Nineteen seventy six. So an older Tolkien. We got another one that is older. This one is the Tolkien Reader, and this is a Ballantine, so I know this one's going to be an older one. Let's see how old this one is. 1966, so 10 years older than the one we just looked at. And then we have a newer one here, <clears throat> Book of Lost Tales Part 1, a Delray. This is a newer one, you can obviously tell, probably 90s, uh, based off the, the spine. But you're going to take home all five of these books. And I'll catch up with chat and see if we got any more bells rung. If you're interested in any of the bundles, just ring the bell under the listing and then I'll run them. Um, I'm going to go actually through and I'll pick the bundles out that have the bells right now as soon as we run this. We'll do $1 for the whole bundle and we'll do 30 seconds. You take home all five books. And Sailor Jedi, drop you a follow. And let me go check out the store and see... Which bells have been rung? The psychology one, science, science library set, and the supernatural one. We got large paperback book bundle, a games bundle, DuckTales bundle. Very cool. All right, board book. All right, let me go grab a couple of these, and then we'll get them uh, running. Let me grab this. It's right next to me, so that's perfect. And this is right next to me as well, and then Par Bundle, Science Bundle, Supernatural, all right, cool, I got some bundles next to me, and these are ones that had bells next to them, nice, Anu's scooping it up, nice take home there on that little Tolkien slash one fantasy book. And that one did have 
former gals of ham, which is a good, that's a good story. So that right there. All right, let's do, let's do this horror thriller bundle that I have next to me. And we got Sanctum in a asylum novel. It's a scholastic, so I know it's not too too scary. It's not too scary. We got Mysteries of Sparrow Island, Birds of a Feather. Now, keep in mind, these are mystery books and horror thriller books for children. So, um, Angels Among Us, another Mysteries of Sparrow Island. Two hardcovers there. And then we have Return of the Wolf, but kids aren't scared of wolves. And the last one in here is another wolf cover, but we got Scary Stories for Stormy Nights. So if I remember correctly, this was like a bootleg scary stories to tell in the dark, but it still was scary. So Ugh, who knows what's going on there? <laughs> scary stories for stormy nights. So a little horror thriller bundle. We got five in this one, and it looks like two out of the five are going to be hard cover. And... We'll do one dollar for the stack. You get all five for a buck. And then when I run a couple more of the bundles that I pulled, I will then go pull some more that have bells next to them, if that makes sense. Welcome, welcome. Chef Barcy, how's it going? Wise men, welcome back. D Thunder, thanks for coming in. Drop you a follow. April Janelle, thanks for coming in. And then Steampunks will drop you a follow too. Thanks for coming in. Jim Menes, Christina, thanks for coming back. Hey, Lord Jupiter scooping up that little thriller bundle. Nice take home there, Lord Jupiter. Very, very nice. This is probably the most interesting one out of the whole bundle. And I even threw a wolf book in there. All right. We got some DuckTales stuff. Woo. -hoo. We're going to do this. This was right next to me. So let's pop this back and we'll scooch that up. All right, first one's going to be a large one. Oh, first one's going to be a large one. Hardcover. We got Disney's DuckTales, Sphinx for the Memories, and Sir Gyro Gearloose. So you got Scrooge and Donald on the cover, which is cool. Next one in the bundle is going to be a flat, a flat reader. It's going to be a golden book. We got the Great Lost Treasure Hunt. So you can tell this one's an OG one. It's got Mrs. Beasley on the front with those uh, Junior Woodchucks. Pretty cool. So that's an older golden book. And now here's a read along Dinosaur Ducks, Disney's DuckTales Story Plus theme song. Next, we got some hardcover books. These are all Disney Wonderful World of Reading, three of them. We got Donald Duck Buys a House. Does have, I believe, the nephews in this one. Yeah, it's got the nephews in there. So we put it in the DuckTales pile. Donald Duck. We got Donald Duck Mountain Climber. And then the last one in this bundle is going to be DuckTales Webby Saves the Day. And you got Launchpad flying the helicopter. Now, in this one, you're going to get six books. They're all DuckTales themed. And we'll start this one at a dollar for everybody, and I'll grab another bundle. And I do have larger bundles, too, of books. As we get into the, the more uh, younger kid books, I have a, a larger stack. So as you'll see next, I'm going to run some board books. Um, you'll see there's a little bit more larger quantity in some of the stacks. So. And Chef Barcy's in there scooping up these ducktail books. Very, very nice. Very nice. And let's, hey, Chef Barcy scooping up that ducktails lot. Nice take home there. All right. Put those over with the sold books. All right. Here's some board books. These are going to be. And Chef will give you a little bit to do that. These are going to be all different sizes. This one has a, um, what's, it, what's it called? Etch-a-Sketch? Etch-a-Sketch etch up top. So by board books, um, I mean they're going to be, you know, each 
pages of board basically. So uh, pretty cool. Anyway, this one has this one's mini and it looks like Daisy Duck themed. And that is uh, Disney Junior. So we'll leave that one on the bottom because it's the largest. And let's check out what else is in here. Next up we got is Little Scholastic, the Tiny Tadpole. Oops. Mickey and Friends, Let's Find Shapes. We got Rainbow Fish from, looks like Chick-fil-A. DK My Toolbox. This one looks pretty cool. Let's check this one out. There's a couple. Freaking missing a wrench there. Jesus Walks on Water. We got Fairy School Days. Good Night Moon. The Ultimate the Ultimate Coke or, Pe or Pepsi. What? The Ultimate Coke or Pepsi. That's a scholastic book. So uh, we got Wizard of Oz, a pop-up book. Interesting. Oh. Yeah, that's pretty cool, actually. Yeah. You got, well, that's, that's a that's a fast tale. That's a three pager right there. That's a fast tale. But you got Wizard of Oz, and then last one, and this one's a Scholastic. It's in all colors. Another Scholastic, but it's a nice little bundle of board books. Um, let me start this. We'll do one dollar for the bundle, and we'll do thirty seconds. Uh, can I see the inside of the hardcover DuckTales? Yep. Oh, wow. This is cool. Oh, let me show you after this auction's over. That's so freaking cool. I'm a DuckTales fan. I didn't even notice this. That's dope. Very cool. And no takers on the board book bundle. All right. Is anybody interested in kids' books today? Let me know. Um, I do have some other bundles that we could run. Here's the inside of this one. It's got launch pad. Just do it. Look at Scrooge. He looks pretty uh, concerned there. And then the other side is same pattern. Is that the one you wanted to see? Is that... You were asking for this one, right? Speaking of that, let me check in on Chef. Looks like Chef took them. Nice. Appreciate you. Awesome. All right. Let me go grab another bundle. And this one over here. Maybe. All right, let's run this uh, science library. Somebody was asking for the science library bundle. Let's run that. All right, first one in this, they're all going to be uh, paperback. This is the facts, the facts on file dictionary of astronomy. So pretty good size book. And they're all the same size, which is nice. We got biotechnology and genetic engineering. Very cool. We got marine science. And lastly, we got is computer science. Facts on file science library. You get four books. Pretty stout, though. Let me get this started. And I think I have it under science library. And we'll do $1 for that. Oh, I think I grabbed the wrong bundle. I grabbed science bundle. But either way, this is the science library bundle. Um, yeah, totally. Yeah, I got you, Joss. Let me go. Actually, I think I have one right next to me. It's got a little button. Oh, there it works. It's got a little dog. And I got readers, too. I don't know if anyone's interested in readers. And it looks like I'm getting bounced out of my own my own auction. All right. Looks like I'm back, I guess. I think I'm back. Thumbs up. I know. I'm back. All right. Here's a, a larger hardcover bundle. I mean, I'm guessing some of the stuff in here would be good for toddlers. Um, 
This one says baby animals, so you know it's got like a little button. It's got a little button. So I'm gonna maybe this would be good for you. Little spiral book. Lawler. Whoops. There we go. Let's, these are kind of large actually. The ripe strawberry and the big hungry bear. These are all going to be hardcover. This one says photo fact collection fish. Ocean's Atlas. Uh, understanding electricity. Yeah, plants. We got a golden book. This one is great castles and palaces. We got How It Works, The Human Body. We got Disney Princess Movie Theater. The Big Book of Real Boats and Ships. We got another pop-up book. This one is Pinocchio. Oh, look at that. Poking, poking, uh, Pinocchio and Geppetto. Pretty cool. And you got Best Loved Nursery Rhymes. And that's another hardcover one. So you get this nice little stack of books here. We got two, four, six, eight, ten. We got 12, 13 books in this stack. And this was large hardcover, I believe. Large size hardcover book bundle. And we'll do $1 for the bundle. 13 books. What's up, my K-Love? How's it going? Drop you a follow. Scudder Bear, drop you a follow. Thanks for coming in. Welcome back, Anu. Amanda the Thrifty Panda, thanks for coming by. Appreciate you. All right, cool. I think I caught up on chat. And then the Supernatural Bundle I'm going to run next because that was one of the ones that was requested in that first round. Hey, Scudder Bear scooping that up. Nice take home there. Nice little 13-book hardcover children's book bundle. Very nice. Various authors in there, too. All right. Next one we got was the Supernatural Bundle. I thought this one was kind of neat, so I put it together for this stream. The first one, these are all going to be hardcover. So this is Mysteries of, Mysteries of the Unknown, Mystic Places, and it's got some wild stuff. Vision of Eden. It's got all kinds of stuff about the Masons in here. A leap across space and time, wormholes, portals, all kinds of stuff. Stonehenge, disappearing ships. It's a time life book, um, and it's called Mysterious Places, and it's part of a series called uh, Mysteries of the Unknown, time life books. We all know time life are good, good books. We got Witches and Witchcraft, another one from time life. Let's see if we can get a little... Got some lady standing in a moo moo. I'm sure there's tons of stuff in here of interest. Again, time life. We got Night Creatures, the Enchanted World series. Ooh, look at some of these creatures. Wow. So this is a supernatural bundle battling the spider demon. That doesn't sound very fun. Time life books. We'll put those there. Some supernatural stuff. All hardcover, and we'll do one dollar on that. Hey, what's up, Mama J? How you doing? Welcome, welcome. Turtle Lovin', how's it going? Thanks for coming in. Hey, you're welcome, Scudder Bear. No problem. No problem. Maybe I thought it was supernatural, the TV show. It's more like supernatural, supernatural. If that makes sense. And then we'll do, we'll do this one. If this is all flats, yeah, we'll do all these next. Let's do this bundle right here. All right. Let's see where we're at. Anybody scooped that up? Anu scooped it up. Nice. Appreciate you. A nice little esoteric bundle. That's what I probably should have called it. Esoteric. Esoteric. 
All right. We got that one. And then somebody was saying psychology they were interested in. I'm gonna pull them, I'm gonna pull them real quick just so I don't have to go back and forth. Here's the science bundle. Uh, I think off the top of my head, there was, oh, the paperback. Paperbacks. Somebody was asking about paperbacks. I'll pull these over here. Perfect. And then I got some bundles to run now. Cool. All right. This first one that we're going to run is going to be large uh, children's flats. These are like, um, well, you'll see. Just flat books. We got what this one on the Aurora Borealis. Looks like we have an Iron Giant comic. We got a Pokemon one. We got Pokemon Forever Scholastic Flats. That's what I should have called it, Scholastic Flats. We got Stick with Hulk, Sticking Time Bomb. You can see Bruce Banner and the Abomination there. Pretty cool. We got a Jurassic Park. Ooh, this is vintage. We got a Lost World Jurassic Park from the 90s coloring activity book. Next, we got Jimmy Neutron Boy Genius, a golden book. Then we got a cool one. This one's I Spy. We got a little Nemo coloring book, it looks like. We got Wild Animals, 1,000 Things You Should Know About. We got Power Rangers Megazord Attacks. We got a book on Jolly Old Santa Claus. We got the goose and the bicycle, it looks like. The goose and the bicycle. Ooh, we got a Star Wars one. Look at this. Uh, Star Wars The Empire Begins. We got Vader on the cover. That's cool. The Great Undersea Search. This one is an award winning book. It says, A Poem for Peter. Poem for Peter. Put that that way. So it's. Oh, last one is a Star Wars one in this bundle. We got Attack of the Clones. Attack of the Clones. So we got some Star Wars stuff, Power Rangers, Pokemon, all kinds of stuff in this one. Let me run. <clears throat> what is this one, large? Where did I put that? Large. Nope, didn't put under large. Small, small, doop, doop, doop. There we go. Where's that? Oh, I just scrolled past it. It's kind of under medium flats. Yeah, I just want to make sure I got the right. There we go. All right. We'll do $1 for the whole bundle of flats. And you got the Pokemon, the Star Wars, all kinds of stuff in this one. Good little mix. Hey, what's up, Art Walker? Pre-bids. Which ones are we talking about? Large paperbacks. Let's pull those out. And let's run those. Thank you for letting me know about that. Awesome. I did not know that. All right. Let me... All right. Let me put these back, and then we'll run the ones that have pre-bids on them. There we go. All right. This is the large. We'll do... So we got one, two, three. Actually, how does it, it I thought I just saw it. It was showing me a second ago. Interesting. It was showing me pre bids a second ago. That's weird. Oh, gotcha. <clears throat> It's reminders. That's what I was looking at. All right, let's do the large paperback bundle. This one is going to be, I guess, a little bit more mature, young adult, I guess you could say. We have Into the Wild. We have Self Reliance by Emerson. We got The Art of Racing in the Rain. The Messies Manual. The Laws of the Spirit World. 
We got the last song, Nicholas Sparks. We got an old copy of Think and Grow Rich. And lastly, we got uh, To Kill a Mockingbird. So a larger size paperback bundle. But you're getting two, four, six, eight books in this one. Large paperback. And we'll do a dollar for the whole stack. And then I'm going to run the psychology one next. I think that was another one that had. Oh, here we go. See, it says three bids. Oh, okay, yeah. That, it's showing me live bids, but it's not showing me pre bids. That's bizarre. So I'm still trying to scroll through here and see. Bizarre. I have not. We can run that next, though. Because I was just running random stuff. I'll run those next. Hey, Art Walker in there scooping up that nice paperback bundle. That a nice take home. All right, here are the readers. Um, it looks like most of these are going to be level one. Level one readers. So perfect for somebody who has a young child. That's good. All right. First one we got in the stack is going to be Step Into Reading with Sesame Street. We got a DK reader. We got Fingerlings. We got Way Down Deep, Strange Ocean Creatures. Splat the Cat, A Whale of a Tail. Dora in the Deep Sea. Planets Around the Sun, a scholastic one. And then we got The Nap. And the last one in here is Paddington's Prize Picture. So let me run. You get the whole stack of readers. Whoops. I think I might have closed that. Yep, there we go. You get the whole stack of readers for a buck. Into 30 seconds. Perfect. Then let me grab another little bundle here. Let me see this. What was the other one? Was, uh, medium size hardcover. Let me grab this. This has two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, thirteen books in the next one. Hey, Scudder Bear, scooping that up. Nice take home there. Some readers, level one, and you got one level two in there. All right, the next one is going to be another children's book bundle, and this one was uh, medium-sized uh, hardcover books. Let me just kind of flip the stack so it's... Size, there we go. First one we got, and this one is going to be, they're all going to be hardcover. The Underwater Alphabet Book. We got the Lion King Pal Patrol. We got My Best Friend. We got Snow White. Next up we got is Cinderella. Happy Healthy Songs, Rapunzel's Challenge, <clears throat> A Song for My Heart, Rapunzel's Forest Friends, Talent Show Songs with Minnie, a lot of Disney stuff in this one, we got PJ Masks, we got All Day Long Songs, Sing With Me. And the last one, and this is Hansel and Gretel. So 13, I'd say medium-sized hardcover books for younger children. So we'll do medium-sized hardcover book bundle, and we'll do $1. Hey, Tiger Eyed Fox, how's it going? Thanks for coming in. Everyday Eclectics, welcome back. 
I'm going to run that psychology book bundle next, if anybody's interested in that. Uh, somebody did have a bell run for it, so I figured I'll run it, see if anybody wants to grab it. Plus, it's right next to me, so. Hey, Art Walker's in there going to scoop up this nice little medium-sized bundle. And then I have some smaller size hardcover chapter books, and I have paperback chapter books if anyone's interested in that as well. Oh, that was a good one. You rang the bell for that one? That was um, three books, but not from the show Supernatural. It was, um, yes, chapter books. You got it. Cool. Is anybody interested in the psychology book bundle? Let me know. Art Walker scooping that up. Appreciate you. Nice take home there. Nice little 13 book bundle. Some hardcover books. Admittedness. All right, let's do um, let's do these chapter books. These are we'll do the paper first, and then we'll do the hardcover ones. <clears throat> All right. Actually, yeah, this one this one's got quite a few. In it. Let's see what we got in this one. Uh, two, four, six, eight. 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24. 24 books in this one. It has a mix, actually. There's chapter books, and there's a couple smaller flats in this one. But we'll run the we'll run the lot. It's got some good chapter books. It's got Frankenstein. It's got some Beast Quests. Let's do here. This is the first book in this lot, which is actually a really cool one. It looks like it's really drawn well. We got the fairy tale book. This is a golden paperback. I love dogs and puppies. Scholastic. What else did I put in here? Warcraft 3. Reign of Chaos. Magical World of Reading with Dumbo. You take a mouse to school. Bear feels sick. Swiss Family Robinson. Dear God, thank you for the friends. The fine art of concentration. Fantastic dragons. Ooh, this one looks cool. The X-Men cartoon maker. What? That's pretty wild. What is this? Interesting. Stamp out library? Maybe this is a... Hmm, I don't know. Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer Activity Book. We got Luke's Life Lessons, a book for a wonderful life. We got Little Lost Sheep, Tonka Chuck and Friends. We got the Cub Scout Tiger Cub Handbook, Boy Scouts of America, The Time We Ran Away. We got Frankenstein, Junior Classic Readers, Babe Ruth, Baseball Legend, another Scholastic. And the last one in here is Beast Quest, Vipero the Snake Man. So a nice little stack of books, that's for sure. And let me pull this up. This was large chapter books, I believe. Um... Paperback chapter book bundle. That would be this. Okay. We'll do one dollar on this whole bundle. We'll do 30 seconds. Chapter books. Yes, I was rushing. Oh dang. Sorry about that. Oh well, see, there you go. Perfect. There you go, Tiger Eyed Fox. Yep, it was not the show. It was uh, I should have put esoteric. That would that would have been better, I think. Esoteric would have been the proper um, title for that. Hey, Scudderberry in there scooping up this bundle. Nice. I'm going to run a paperback bundle next. And then we'll come back to some of the hardcover stuff. Hey, Scudderberry in there scooping that up. Nice take home there. Very nice take home. All right. Let me put this over here. And then. Yeah, this one's got some cool books in it. All right. All right. 
this is we count that uh, two uh four six eight nine books in this one but there's some good ones and we'll check them out all right first one we got in here is the summons by john grisham then we have tales of mystery edgar Allan poe we got dickens a christmas carol al capone the master key to riches napoleon hill the Wind in the Willows. This one's cool. It's got a um, it's got a curved corner. That's interesting. Curved corner on that book. That's an Avon Press. We got Great Tales and Poems of Edgar Allan Poe. We have The Sum of All Fears. And lastly, we have 1984. And this is a Signet Classic copy of 1984. So you're going to get that whole stack of paperbacks. And we'll do a dollar. Now, where did I put this? Small paperback book bundle. One dollar. There we go. Perfect. Nice. Yeah, that was a good one. The scary stories to tell in the dark is, uh, or is this for Stormy Nights? Stormy Nights is a good pickup. Now, let me go through and see what other bells are on here. Um, what to expect. Let me grab that one. I'm going to go back to uh, running things that have bells on them. I'm going to grab the, the what to expect bundle. A nice three book bundle. Big books. We'll go back to chat. Whoops. How do in there? Nice. Take home on the paperback book bundles. Very nice. A copy of 1984 is worth it alone right there. Check that out. OG one, too. All right. Somebody was ringing the bell for this next bundle, so we'll start with this one. We got What to Expect the First Year. And that's a big one. That's a heavy book, I guess you could say. And then What to Expect... The first year, but it's different? I'm not sure. But you get both of them. And then eating well when you're expecting. So a nice little bundle there of big books. That, that run next button is super tempting. And then I'm going to grab another bundle with the bell on it. Ooh, the science bundle. Let me grab that next. Right here. Oh, this one's got some wild stuff in it. It's got some stuff on physics, chemistry, the universe. The science bundle should be interesting. And there's the what to expect when you're expecting bundle. What's up, Chris Hands? How's it going? Drop your follow. Welcome back, Top Shada. How's it going? All right, no takers on that. All good. This in the back. All right, let's run the science one. Let me flip this thing upside down. I guess this one's like science slash esoteric, you could say. We got some interesting stuff in here. We got Alan Watts. Looks like this is a – holy moly. We got 12 cassettes, Out of Your Mind by Alan Watts. You are being lied to, Barnes and Noble. Book on feng shui. Safari book, travel and leisure. 50 years of the safari. Next we got singularity theory, uh, introduction to catastrophe theory. Ghosts of Gettysburg. I don't know why I put that in there, but that's a cool book to put in here. We got Daily Life in the Ancient World. Geometry, Relativity, and the Fourth Dimension. New Outline of the First Year of College Physics. Chemistry, a quick reference. And then we got Experiencing Hubble, Understanding the Greatest Images of the Universe. So, uh, oh, yeah, a science slash esoteric 
little bundle there. We're going to run that. We'll do a dollar for that, and we'll do 30 seconds. What's up, Merchant Lapa? What's going on? Amanda Acosta, how's it going? Now let me scroll through and see what was next. Psychology is next. We'll run that. Then we'll do the international bundle, the games bundle, the education activity book bundle, the board book bundle. I think we already ran it, but we can run it again. It looks like somebody rang the bell for that. And we'll go in that order for now, everybody. All right, no takers on the science bundle. All good. Move that. Back there, here's the psychology bundle. This one has some psychology books. We got Man and His Symbols by Carl Jung. Hardcover on that one. Be careful of what you want. You might get it. We got the DSM-4. It's a big one. We got Behaviorism with B.F. Skinner. And lastly, we got an Intention Deficit Disorder Manual. So a nice little bundle of psychology books we'll do a dollar for the stack and we'll do 30 seconds and you're going to get two four five books in this bundle we're going to do the games one next what's up trish how you doing welcome in we're on the games one next after this one and if there's any that you want just let me know in the chat or ring the bell next to the listings i'm just going to go in order and uh, pull ones that have the bell rung. So, all right, we'll take us on the psychology bundle. Put that aside. All right, next one is the games bundle. This one, what does this one have? Two, four, six, eight books. We got defensive drills for basketball. I think that's the only sports one in this one. We got World's Best Card Tricks, Robert's Rules of Order. We got Rules of Chess, Rules of Card Games. So card tricks, card games. We got a chess strategist, a chess rules book, and then we also have a Rules of Games book from Hoyle. So there you go. Nice little bundle. And we'll run this one at a buck for everybody. And we'll do 30 seconds. And let me see what the next bell is going to be. We'll run the board books, I guess, next, because that, that has a bell on it. And then we'll do the educational activity books, which is a pretty good bundle, actually. Let me see. Ooh, the international one. Got that bundle too. Cool. All right. No takers on the games bundle. All good. I'll put that one aside. And then try asking for the international bundle. I went right past it, went to games, but here is that one. I'll show you what books are in that book bundle. We got rice, beans, and pasta. Homestyle Chinese cooking. Practical Chinese conversation. We got the New Standard Spanish Dictionary. This one's hardcover. That's a large book, actually. We got a book on ginseng. A Chinese to English dictionary. And the last one in this one is Italian at a Glance. And you get this whole bundle of six books. And we'll do a dollar. Oop. Perfect. And then I'll pull the board books and the children's activity books over. Unless anyone has any other requests. Because I think those are the last, the last two with bells on them. And then I'll probably run 
Is anybody interested in the golf bundle or a bundle involving fishes or aquarium life? Let me know. Golf, fish. I have a science library bundle. I have hardcover storybooks, chapter books, I should say. Um, board books, large flats. Uh, and that's pretty much what's over there right now. Let's see what we got here. Hey, Scudder Bear scooping up that. Nice bundle there. Very cool. Nice take on it. Appreciate it. Look at this right there. All right, this is going to be children's activities books. Tons of stuff in this one. This, this is a larger bundle, probably one of the larger ones that I have. We'll do it like this. All right, we got problem set booklet to start off everything. Tem template and exit booklet. And I think those are like school books, but everything else in here. We got puzzle mania, trace and learn. Decisions and Outcomes. We got a Highlights for Children. We got Complete Book of Handwriting. We got The Biosphere. We got My World Social Studies. We got Colors and Shapes. Daily Language Review. 50 Great States. Folk and fairy tale mini books. We got Spectrum Test Prep. Master Skills Reading. Nonfiction Reading Comprehension. Uh, thematic Unit Fairy Tales. IBD and Me Activity Book. The Mailbox. Spectrum Test Prep. Spelling skills, math expressions. We got a book on phonics, seasonal bulletin boards that teach, holiday poems, prayers, and projects. So lots of books, especially if you're doing homeschooling, I guess. This might help out. Let's do... Um, one dollar, and we'll do 30 seconds. Educational activity books. Again, you get the whole stack. What's up, Jim? How's it going? Drop you a follow. M. Parrish, what's going on? Dazon, what's going on? Zin, what's happening? McLovin, welcome in, welcome in. Brittany22, welcome back. All right. Educational Activity Book Bundle. I'm going to run some Cliff Notes next. See if anybody wants any of these Cliff Notes. It's um, got a good one in this one. It's got a whole huge one on Greek classics. So, wow, that's a big book. We'll run that one next. I'll run the uh, Cliff Notes just in case anybody wants to scoop them up. What's up, Kimberly Smith? How's it going? Welcome in. Punka, thanks for coming in. Again, children's activity books going to Scudder Bear. Appreciate you on that. Looks like we got basically grades one through four there and a bunch of activities in the middle. So nice take home there on that bundle. That's a nice one. Let me slide this over here. There we go. Perfect. All right. Next one's going to be. We got some cliff notes, so we'll run this one. We got great expectations. We have cliff notes on mythology. This is a, a larger one, too. Spanish one. We got spark notes on great expectations. And then we have a tale of two cities. We got Greek classics. This was the big one. Cliff notes. And then we got basic math and pre-algebra. So you're going to get all these. You got two, four, six, seven of them. And we'll do a dollar on these. And then I'm going to do 
one more kids bundle after this. And then I'll go through all the ones I have left and see if anybody wants any of them. I'll rerun them. And then we'll do the buyer appreciation giveaway at the uh, at the end. And again, the buyer appreciation giveaway is going to be for the three pack of Hallmark books. And one of those is a uh, velvet copy of The Secret Garden. So someone's going to take those three home tonight from Hallmark, or today, I should say, from Hallmark. So let me do a dollar for this whole stack of Cliff Notes, and we'll see what's going on in chat. The game books. Uh, game books. Let me snatch those. So it's card games, uh, chess, and card tricks. And card tricks. So it's like um, old school hoils. I'll show you as soon as this listing is done. Oh, yeah. I always do bundles. Uh, you can't really do singles. McLovin scooping it up. Nice take home there on the cliff notes. Um, can't really do singles too often. Uh, I mean, I guess you could now because of media mail, but prior to it was, uh, it was difficult to do singles because you're almost paying more sometimes for shipping than you would for the, the book itself. So the games bundles is going to be, um, stuff like this. And I have, what is it? Card tricks. Mm, parliamentary law. I don't think Robert's Rules of Order should be in this bundle, but uh, yeah. <laughs> All right, let's run a a kids book. Appreciate you, McLovin, on that. Let's run another kids book bundle. Um, this is a flats bundle. Then we got the board books. So maybe we'll run these together, and then I'll just I'll have to do an adjustment. All right, let me. All right, so I'm gonna run a nice little bundle for kids books. This will be a good like last kids book bundle, and then the rest of the stuff um, is gonna pretty much be science, fish, stuff like that. Like I guess stuff you learn in school. So, and we can go through those too, and I can maybe make a nice custom bundle. But this one will have some good stuff in it. Promise. All right. I probably have to make an adjustment to the label, but that's fine. First one we got in this one is Attack of the Clones, Star Wars. We're going to do a poem for Peter, The Great Undersea Search. We got The Empire Begins, Star Wars. We got The Goose and the Bicycle. We got Santa Claus, Power Rangers, Super Legends. We got a huge book on wild animals, huge by large. We got little Finding Nemo, Little Nemo, Finding Nemo, something about Nemo. We got I Spy. This one's cool. Take a little break and we'll check out some stuff in here. G, pretty cool. I Spy. We got Jimmy Neutron. This one has that old school 90s Lost World Jurassic Park activity book. Then we got Stick with Hulk. Then we got Pokemon Forever. Pokemon Forever. We got the Iron Giant. Looks like it's a comic. Warner Brothers. We got the Aurora Borealis. A little story about that. And then I'm going to throw the, book, the board books in here as well. So we'll throw those on top. And like I said, we'll do a nice little bundle of kids books for somebody today to scoop up. This one is the Etch-A-Sketch Mini with the board book. There we go. Etch a sketch mini with the board book. It looks like you got mini and Daisy Duck here at the bottom. And then you got to etch a sketch up top to draw the lessons. Again, these are all board books now. And these are going to be in this bundle as well. So you're going to get the whole stack. In all colors, we got that pop up book from The Wizard of Oz. Very cool. I think this was the three pager. Had three pop-up stories in it. We'll check this one out because I thought this one was cool before. You got the ultimate Coke or Pepsi. Goodnight Moon. Fairy School Days. Jesus Walks on Water. We got DK's My Toolbox. 
Rainbow Fish from Chick-fil-A. Let's find shapes with Minnie. We got the Tiny Tadpole. Now, I got some other kids' books here. I'm going to throw in this as well. We got, oh, that's not a kid's book. It's all about me. Sometimes ones just get tossed in here that aren't kids' books. Now, this one I thought was actually cool. I was going to snatch this one for myself. But we got The Incredible Journey. Um, basically, it's Homeward Bound. But uh, it's an OG copy. Let's see how old this is. I was going to snatch this one. Let's see what year we got. 1961. So 1961 on this uh, Homeward Bound, The Incredible Journey. Cool book, though. We got a sketchbook with a dragon on it. I'm sure some kids would love that. Next up we got is, here we'll do this one first, Animal Tracks of Southern California, and then a reference book about dogs. And the last one, we're going to throw another vintage one in here. We got Just So Stories, Rudyard Kipling. Let's see what year we got for this. Ooh, nice illustrations. 1965. So OG one. When it comes to kids' books, we'll put that right top. Oh, the other side has The Prince and the Pauper. So pretty cool. It's double. It's a double one back-to-back. -back. So that's a nice little bundle right there of kids' books, and we'll do this at a buck. Where are we at? Um, this was medium hardcover chapter books. We'll just do that. We'll cannibalize this and we'll do, I'm going to do kids mixed and I'll just have to adjust this. Shoot. That's all right, perfect. That's going to be a heavy one. All right. We'll do $1 on this one. And where are we at? Boom. And we'll do 30 seconds on it. So with your strengths, that probably shouldn't be in this one. All right. I got a book on, I got a book stack on genetics. Um, I have a stack of old price guides for sports cards from the nineties. I have a bundle on psychology. We have a science bundle. I have a golf bundle. We have a games bundle, which maybe I can make something cool with those two together. Maybe I'll do that. And maybe I'll do this science stuff together. And we'll do this. Do those and then I'm going to run a couple of these anyway, just to run them. And then we'll run the buyer appreciation giveaway. So I'll give everybody a little bit of an opportunity if they want to scoop up any other ones. Let's see what's going on with the kids bundle. And McLovin in there scooping that up. Nice take home there. Let me drop some more follows before we scroll down in the chat. Okay, oops. Jody, OJ. Nice. All right, cool. Let me put this one aside. This one right there. Perfect. All right. I'm going to run this science bundle and then. I'll run the last few ones that I have, and then we'll do the buyer appreciation giveaway. How does that sound for everybody? You don't have to confirm. I'm just letting you know what I'm doing. <laughs> All right. First one in here we got is the Facts on File Dictionary of Astronomy. Next one we got is Biotech and Genetic Engineering. Then we got Marine Science. Very cool. These are all the Facts File Library. We got computer science. Next one we got is singularity and catastrophe theory. Then we got first year of college physics outline. We got daily life in the ancient world. 
We got understanding the greatest images of the universe. We got clicks, clicks, quick review, chemistry, and then we got geometry, relativity, and the fourth dimension. A heavy hitting, deep science bundle. And then here, speaking of deep, we'll throw this on top. We'll throw the uh, the Alan Watts cassette thing, audio books that I had earlier. So there's all the cassettes in this one as well. We'll throw that on top to make it even more deep. So esoteric science bundle. We'll do a dollar on this. And boom. And then I'm going to run the last couple ones just in case anybody wants to scoop them up. I'm going to run the fish and aquarium one. Any sci-fi fan? I did fantasy. No sci-fi, I don't think. Do I have any sci-fi? I, I think this is about as sci-fi sci as it's going to get right here uh, would be this bundle. And McLovin's in there. This is uh, probably got the most sci-fi stuff, I guess you could say, with the general relativity and fourth dimensional stuff. And the facts on file. And somehow Ghost of Gettysburg was in this the first time. Hey, Scudder Bear, scooping that up. Nice take home there. You're taking home that beautiful science slash esoteric style bundle. And you're getting Alan Watts, which is nice. All right. Like I said, I'm going to run the last few bundles and then we'll do the buyer appreciation giveaway just to make sure everyone gets a shot at. Now, I know this might be some heavy information, but we're gonna run it anyway, because I think it's a, I think it's a cool bundle to at least check out. So if you're not interested in scooping it up, it's totally understandable. The stuff kind of goes over my head a little bit too. So this is um, Laboratory Exercises in Cell Biology. This is a, an old, older textbook bundle. We got Guide to Learning Anatomy and Physiology. Next up we got is Experiments in Animal Development. Then we have Chordate Development. So again, this is like a textbook bundle, if you would. And the last one in this is gonna be a primer of genetic analysis, a problems approach. So a nice little genetic bundle, I guess you can say. And I'll run this. <laughs> there you go. Nice. What did I put it under, though? That's the question. I don't have many left. So biology lab, maybe? We'll do that. Biology lab. We'll do $1 for the biology lab book bundle. And then... I think that pretty much clears out all the science stuff. This is the last one for science. What's up, TB? How you doing today? Let me drop you a follow. Thanks for coming in. Flan Pillow. I didn't say it earlier, but thanks for coming back. Always nice. And McLovin's in there. Nice. What am I gonna run next? I think this aquarium bundle will go next, and then we'll do the we'll run the games one. McLovin scooping that up. Nice. Appreciate you. That is awesome. Grab these. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Next one we got is gonna be some aquarium, or I should say fish undersea. We're gonna say under the sea books. I only got about maybe four or five more bundles, four more bundles we'll run, and then we'll do the um, buyer appreciation giveaway, which is going to be a three-book bundle from Hallmark, and one of those is going to be a velvet copy of The Secret Garden, and you get to take all three of these home today um, just for making a purchase. Get yourself in there. So we got all about undersea exploration. Next one in this bundle is... Common Marine Fishes of California. Then we got the Handbook of Tropical and Aquarium Fishes. We got Prevention and Care of Tropical Fish Diseases. And lastly, it looks like we got a DVD um, on the Great Barrier Reef. So nice little under-the-sea bundle, if you would. 
And here I'll throw in this book on on safaris. Fifty years, fifty years on safari. We'll throw that in there. So you got some land, and sea. You got surf and turf. Let's call this a surf and turf bundle, right? That's a good one. Let me do here. There we go. Now it's proper. We'll do the surf and turf bundle for one buck. Yeah, the secret garden book's pretty cool. It's got like a velvet cover. I know when I took a picture of it, it kind of looked like this picture was messed up, but it was just glare from the photo. Yeah, that one's that one looks pretty cool on the inside too. Nice and clean. But yeah, surf and turf. You're gonna get two, four, six books in this little bundle here. And then I got the games one. I'm gonna run. I'm gonna run these. I think I'm gonna run these card ones next because I didn't run those yet. Hey, McLevin in there scooping it up. Appreciate you. Nice take home there. Let me scoop this here. And let me grab. All right. So these are gonna be. I don't know. These are going to be fun to look through. I can tell you that. Let's check them out together, shall we? So I got some OG price guides from the 90s. Uh, this is from 98, and it's a Beckett with Mark McGuire on the front. Pretty cool. Next, we got a Scotty Pippen cover for Sports Card Price Guide monthly from 93. That's an OG. We got another 93 here. We got... Uh, Joe Montana on the front of Sports Card Price Guide as well. We got an OG. We got Ken Griffey on the front of Tough Stuff. I actually think I had this one when I was a kid. And this one is from uh, 2000. I'll we'll say 99 or 2000. But July 2000 on that one. Next, we got the Frank Thomas, the Big Hurt. He's on the front cover of December 1992's Price Guide. Sports Card Price Guide. No idea this guy is Brett Hall, I'm going to guess, but Price Guide from 93. Cal Ripken cover, February 93. We got, speaking of Cowboys, they just dropped the Troy Aikman Funko Pop today, but you can grab this Emmett Smith cover of Beckett in this little bundle. We got Beckett's Babe Ruth cover. For the 100 years anniversary of Babe Ruth. And lastly, we're going to throw in this Beckett Baseball Price Guide number 16. So it's a nice nice little bundle there of some older price guides from the 90s and one from 2000. So I'll run these, see if anyone wants to scoop these up. And then I got two more bundles, and then we'll do the buyer appreciation giveaway. And then we'll call it. All right, we'll do $1. We'll do 30 seconds on this price guide bundle. I'm going to run the games one, then we'll run the psychology one, and then we'll do the buyer appreciation giveaway. So let me scoot over and grab these real fast. I'm throwing the feng shui one in with the psychology bundle because I, I feel like it goes with that. I don't know. I feel like it goes with that. McLovin's in there going to scoop it up. Nice. Hey, it's a nice bundle, especially some not early 90s um, price guys. Let me grab. Let's do. I'm going to squash these together. We're going to call it Sports and games sports and games this one's a sports and games book bundle that's what we're going to do we're going to mix them together because i only had like three golf books so we'll put the golf books in with the, the game ones and we'll just call it a a sport and game bundle how does that sound all right first one in this go perfect we'll do it by size we got 101 defensive drills for basketball 
Then we got, let's go size-wise. We got a hardcover copy of Guide to the World's Greatest Golf Destinations. Pretty cool. We got golf shorts. And then USGA's Rules of Golf. All right, now let's do some of the games. We got World's Best Card Tricks. Official Rules of Chess. Official Rules of Card Games. We got the Complete Chess Player. And lastly, in this bundle, we got Hoyle's Rules of Games. So some games and a couple sports books. We'll call it that. Um, There it is. And we'll do $1 for this whole stack right here. I'm going to run the psychology one next, and then we'll run the buyer appreciation giveaway. Let's do that. I'll do this psychology book bundle next. Perfect. Hey, McLevin in there. Appreciate you. Tiger Comics, drop you a follow. Thanks for coming in. Peyton's mom, thanks for coming by. Appreciate you. Michelle, thanks for popping in. Leon's mom, thanks for coming by. Appreciate everyone for coming in today. Uh, hang tight. If you made a purchase, we're going to be running the buyer appreciation giveaway in just about one auction. So if you're here listening to me, uh, just know we're going to do the three books, and I'm also going to do a pull from the pencil box. So get a retro pull from the pencil box and the three Hallmark books, which is pretty cool. McLevin in there scooping it up. Appreciate you. That's a nice little bundle there. You get some sports sports books and some games. Put that there. All right. Here's the psychology one. And I threw the feng shui in there. All right. Speaking of feng shui, we'll start off with that one. So we got the clearing clutter. For good feng shui, there you go. Oops, I need to swap this. Let's do Carl Jung, Man and His Symbols. Be careful of what you want. You might get it. You are being lied to. The Disinformation Guide to Media Distortion. We got the DSM-4, so mental, little mental health psychology bundle, if you would. We got About Behaviorism by B.F. Skinner. We'll throw this Robert Rules of Order in there, Parliamentary Procedure. Well, the last two we got in here is Soar With Your Strengths. And then Attention Deficit Disorder. So a little psychology book bundle a couple of them are hardcover i believe three of them but you're getting two four six eight nine books nine books not too bad um boobity boobity boop psychology and we'll do one dollar on this and then we'll run the buyer appreciation giveaway after this which will be three three hallmark books and you get a pull from the the pencil box so pretty cool McLevin in there, appreciate you. Whoops, I swiped away my chat. Turtle Man, drop you a follow. Thanks for coming in today. I'll get this deleted here. Remove from live show. Remove from live show. The thing I'm noticing is if I don't remove these items from my stream, they will show up in my marketplace for some for some reason. I don't know why. Let's see. Hey, McLevin in there scooping it up. Appreciate you. You got a nice box of books coming, that's for sure. This right here. Let me grab my pencil box. Grab these books. Put that back by the wadi. And then we get this pinned. 
Boobity boop, boom. We'll pin that. So it looks like, let me let everybody know. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, six unique purchases. So as soon as we hit six entries, we can draw the winner or we can just let it run out um, until and give everybody a shot who made a purchase to get in there. So we get six entries. We'll draw the winner because that's how many unique purchases we got. And then we'll uh, draw the winner. We got make sure it is six and it's not five yes perfect like i said the uh the secret garden is is a nice copy of it i don't think it's illustrated that's what i was looking for earlier i didn't know oh there's some illustrations i guess i always like to see how they do the illustrations in these like deluxe books That I think oh, we got another illustration. Illustration alert. Scared. Oh, I got some a couple more illustrations in here. Very cool. And then we got the joys of friendship and all Hallmark books. And then we got Soul Spa. And then a pull from the retro pencil box which is always my favorite to dig in there. I'll just kind of put that right there for everybody. What's up, Six Pack Breaks? How's it going? Thanks for coming in. All Dana, thanks for popping in. Appreciate you. Anybody's interested, next week I'll be doing uh, Consumer Electronics on Tuesday, and Wednesday is going to be uh, back here, actually, in the book category. I'll be doing magazines. Um, I have... Bundles of magazines put aside. I have annual sets um, bundled up, all different kinds of stuff. Uh, everything from home improvement to flowers and all kinds of stuff. I think there's handgun stuff. There's hot rod stuff. I think I got consumer consumer reports, I want to say. Is it consumer reports? Popular mechanics, all kinds. of like Literally almost every popular have a magazine I should have next Wednesday, so a week from today. No National Geographic's actually. I, for some reason, tend to sell those in my book auctions. Um, it's going to basically be everything except for National Geographic. I think I got like Hot Rod stuff. I got Low Rider. Um, I know that's not what you asked for. I was just trying to name off stuff that I remember I had put aside. I think there's Time Magazine stuff. Yeah. But it's good to know you like National Geographic because, um, yeah, I'll bring some to the table next time I do a book auction. Yes, tons of crafting mags, uh, stitchery stuff. There's home crafting. Um, there was a, what was a country par a country parade? I think is what it's called. It looked like there was a lot of crafting stuff in that. So it'll be good. Next, it's next Wednesday, and like I said, I do dollar starts on all my stuff. So yeah, come grab some good deals and some magazine bundles. Hey, perfect. I appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you, Scudder Bear. It should be fun. Like I say, I get all this stuff when I buy my books, and then I just sort it. And every once in a while, I can kind of do an auction if it's if I have enough of the specific stuff. Like if I have enough magazines, I can actually run an auction. Then I will. Same thing goes for kids' books. A lot of the times, I'll just have just kid book auctions where it's just kids' books. This one, I had some other stuff I mixed into. That was actually left over from an auction last week that I didn't sell. So I figured I'd add it in here anyway just to see if anybody wanted it. So, All right. We got about 50 seconds left. Anybody interested who made a purchase want to grab themselves an entry, feel free to. We got four entries, six unique purchases. So we get a possibility of six total entries. So, Um... A couple things, yeah. Are you the whatnot, McLovin? I, I didn't want to ask you. That. I didn't know if it was or not. But yeah, I, um, I had to delete them. I so what I do is I have to delete the listings, or for some reason, if I don't delete my listings before the stream's over, um, it will basically dump the unsold listings into my uh, marketplace store, and then they can't be removed. So what I've been doing as a workaround is deleting everything. So. 
That's what I've been doing. So yeah, it looks like I sold everything, but yeah, I deleted a couple of listings out of there. Hey, McLovin, nice take home. Let's grab you some pencils. Let's grab you some pencils. That's a really nice copy of the Secret Garden from Hallmark. Let's grab you some pencils. We'll pull two pencils out of here for you. Let's see what we got. First one we got is Feeney County Historical Museum. Hours one to five daily. Let's grab you another one. Let's grab you another one. What do we got? We got a sharpened Lisa Frank pencil, but since you pulled the Lisa Frank one, let me grab the rest of them for you. Because I only had three in here. And the, there's the third one. I only had three, but we'll get you all three of them. So you got two sharpened ones, and you got one unsharpened Black Widow. Look at that. The Black Widow from 1989. Freaking blast from the past. But Lisa Frank, OG, all of them are from 89, I believe. Oops. There we go. I'll, I, it was only um, one book, and I don't even know if I'm actually going to sell it because it has some it has some stuff here on the side. I didn't want it has some like splatter items. Like, nah, I'm not going to sell that. So, yeah, don't worry about it. You're it's all good. Appreciate you. Hey, no worries. Yeah, like I said, you got some at least a Frank goodness. So that's a that's a good take home. These are the only sharpened ones in here because I said if someone grabs the Lisa Franks, we'll give them all three. Two sharpened and one un one unsharpened. So appreciate everyone. Thanks for coming by today. And like I said, I'll be back again in this category next Wednesday uh, for magazines. So if you're interested, come on by and check out what we got going on for magazines. So, hey, Vegas, thanks for coming in. All right, everyone, have a good one and enjoy the rest of your day.